This is the Creative Stitchers and Hobbycrafts exhibition, held each year at the SECC in Glasgow. Around 17,000 people will enjoy four days of the very best in creative hobbies. The show includes free demonstrations and opportunities to get hands-on with new materials and techniques for beginners and the more experienced. That's pure jute fibre that's been dyed by Nutseam. It stirs in really nicely and mixes in with the other fibres that actually come from recycled paper. Mould and deco go into the vat. I form the paper on the screen, give it a little shake, drain the water away gently with a soft sponge, which helps it to stiffen up. It then goes over to the couching table and it couches nicely in one piece. After they've had some air, they get put up on the clothes peg line and here you can see some jute paper that I made previously. This is obviously a massive, extreme knitting. It's using up selvages. You can see there where the end, the fringes of the blankets would be. Selvages of blankets which would normally be thrown out. So it's a sort of an eco-friendly thing but you can make so many different things with it. The event has been growing for 23 years and now dominates the country's largest exhibition centre, drawing crowds from across Scotland. It's an inspiring, creative craft spectacular. Come twice a year, you my friends. The variety you get in here and the prices are absolutely wonderful. It shows you all the different uh, things that are coming up in craft. Uh, you get a really good selection here as well, you know, with all the different stalls. Uh, but I certainly have found everything I was looking for. Come here every year um, and absolutely love it. It's a day out for me and my cousins, so absolutely love it here. Jane Bolsover explains to potential newcomers the satisfaction of crafting something yourself. It's not just about making the thing, it's about getting there's so much more you get from it. It's the satisfaction of having, I've made this, I've done this, it's great. And also receiving the handmade, whether it's a card or a gift, is so much more special because obviously the person's put time and effort into actually creating that thing. A wide range of age groups made the journey to Glasgow, proving that craft work isn't just for the older generations. And what I'm enjoying most is the fact that young people are starting to get into it. My grandmother taught me to sew, but then we had a section where children didn't learn in schools and then the parents didn't have to, so you don't actually know how to pass the skills on. But now we're finding there's lots of after-school clubs and that children are getting into it. They're loving doing beading and simple stitching and belt making because it, it is a really great thing to do and not just girls, boys as well like making things. And the future indeed looks bright, shown here by the stylish catwalk show hosted by the students of Cardonald College. By the end of each day, folk will have learnt new skills from embroidery to braiding and from what to wear to how to earn money from your crafts. Now that's value for money. Mark Heathcote, the SECC in Glasgow. It's different every time I come. There's new things to see. And there's a lot of stuff here that, uh, that enables you to get on with it, aye, definitely. This is my highlight of the year. This is where I can run riot. 